Hello, welcome to 10 for Tech, Do-It's web show that takes up to 10 minutes to share tips for optimizing your use of technology. I'm Michael. On this week, we want to introduce you to a fairly new productivity tool called Sway. Part of the Office 365 suite, Sway is an easy-to-use digital storytelling app used for creating interactive reports, presentations, newsletters, and more. With Sway, you can bring your simple presentations to life with exciting creative content. Let's take a look at how you can go from start to finish in just minutes with Sway. Exhibit. Come a little bit closer so you can see this amazing creature called Squishy. You have ideas and projects that are interesting, meaningful, powerful. Now there's a new app that helps you easily pull together, format, and showcase them, while still giving you freedom to adjust the design and reflect your own unique style. Introducing Sway, a completely new way to express yourself. Search a wide variety of sources without leaving the app. And simply drag and drop your content directly into Sway. Sway gives you the power to assemble and present your ideas. All just a tap or click away. It lets you create a polished, living, breathing canvas of your ideas on the web using a variety of multimedia that you bring together with ease. Select a layout and style for your content, or let Sway do it automatically by showing suggested combinations for you to consider and change at any time. Seamlessly integrated with the web, social networks, and your devices, your creation can be shared as effortlessly as sending a link and will look great on any screen. Sway lets you easily pull together, format, and share your ideas on any device from anywhere. It's an all-in-one elegant solution that's unlike anything you've used before. We use presentations for all sorts of reasons, to educate, to enlighten, to energize. I created a presentation to promote a teacher training workshop focused on film and animation. I like the idea of a presentation that lived online and could be shared easily with a link, so I chose Sway. I drafted an outline of the presentation in Word. Now I can drag this document into Sway and it automatically creates the headings and sections. I have no idea how that happens, but I think it's awesome. Once in Sway, I can update and change the formatting of these text cards. I added emphasis to phrases I really wanted to stand out. Accent is another way to draw attention to text in a more subtle manner. I have a group of images that show the hands-on nature of this workshop, so I added those onto the storyline. From there, I made a group. Generally, I like to have just a few things on the screen at a time for a presentation, and I'm going to use headers to emphasize the sections visually. I'm going to go back to the storyline and add some focus points to this image. Focus points help me define what's important in an image. In this case, I wanted a view of the curator leading a tour. Looking at this in the horizontal panoramic view, I really like the way the content slides into view and almost gives a preview of what's next. There were some great teacher-created movies. I wanted to include my favorite one towards the end. I copied the YouTube link and pasted it into the insert pane here. Sway finds the video clip and I drop it in. The purpose of this presentation was to give teachers the gist of this workshop quickly with text, images, and a couple videos. And Sway made this super fast. Check out the other videos in this series by clicking on the thumbnails. Hopefully, these videos will inspire you to try out Sway and share your own story. There you have it. It's time to rethink what presentations can be. Sway can really bring your project to life by letting you enhance and customize your content. With Sway's versatility and your creativity, the potential to create unique presentations is truly limitless. Thanks for joining us on this week's 10 for Tech. My name is Michael. And remember, it's really not that hard. <laughs>